So you often wonder, why is there attack meter and defense meter? Depending on what moves you use, one bar from one or one bar from each will be used. So for example, if I knock Katana down, and Katana decides to do wake up up three, she spends a bar of attack and defensive meter. The bars regenerate over time, but you still have to manage your meter because now, see how I have no bars? I basically cannot get up with a wake up attack. Another one is because sometimes the bars will change the properties of special moves. So for example here, when I'm playing Katana, if I do an enhanced fan toss, I will toss two projectiles instead of one. And if I set Joker to duck, the second projectile will hit because it hits a ducking opponent. This is a good example for Joker too, because if you look at Joker, he does the same thing. His regular projectile will not hit ducking opponents, but when you amplify it, it will. And as you see there, this one also costs a bar. So those are examples of why you have attack and defensive meter. Each one is used for different properties of attacks and definitely use them to the best of your ability and give yourself the upper hand in Mortal Kombat 11. If you have any questions, feel free to comment in the comments below. Don't be shy, I'll help you out. Everyone started somewhere. If you liked the video, hit the subscribe button and have fun playing MK11. If not, have a good day and finish him.